Hello, this is Raziel Cohen with ndftraining.com and today I want to show you guys a laser training system from Laser Ammo. Now, I have made videos in the past on dry fire, which is a very, very important aspect of being able to be a proficient and good shooter for many different reasons why and we're going to cover that today. So Laser Ammo sent me a few different types of lasers that they have as well as target systems that we're going to be speaking about and I want to show you the pros of why using a system like this is very valuable to people and why I think a lot of people are not involved in it when they should be. So First of all, let's speak about dry fire for a second. Me as a shooter who shoots quite often, dry fire training is extremely important to be able to be more proficient and be able to do training drills that you won't be able to do at a range. So what is dry fire? Dry fire is taking a either fake gun or non live firing ammo, so not real ammunition, and practicing all the mechanics of using a firearm without actually having the gun go off. So there are seven fundamentals to be able to make a gun fire efficiently, and one of those fundamentals is going to be the gun actually firing. But all the other fundamentals don't require the gun to go off. So if you're going to pra practice concealed carry, right, practicing the draw from your holster doesn't need the gun to fire, but that's a mechanic that is very important to practice. So you can make sure you can have the gun clear your garments correctly and be able to get a proper shot on proper proper shot on target, again, without the gun needing to go off. Now, another aspect to this, which is a part of the video you guys might have seen that I did recently, when I was using the system, I was using it inside a car. A lot of ranges are not going to allow you to shoot from within a vehicle. Also, shooting from within a vehicle is a horrible experience. If you ever shot from within a car before, the glass is going to shatter, then glass particles get into the air, it can really cut your legs up, different things like that, and it's not a fun thing to be able to practice consistently. So if you want to practice vehicle tactics without the risk of actually doing that or needing to blow through hundreds and hundreds of windows, then using dry fire is a good way to be able to practice the mechanics, again, without actually doing so. Another side thing is that if you're going to practice high risk drills, so close retention shooting, things like that, using dry fire could be beneficial in that way, again, because it really takes away the risk while still being able to practice the mechanics safely so you could build up to the point of actual comfort. So what this is from laser ammo, now this is again uh, something that's very specifically unique. They do have laser guns, you're able to use like things like pistols that are gonna be more like commonly available, but what really makes them shine is this system that is able to switch out the bolt in your AR-15 and mix your standard AR-15 into a dry fire practicing gun. So the way that it works is you take any standard AR-15 that you have, you simply remove the bolt that is in that AR-15 and you replace it with this guy right over here that just slips in just like your regular bolt carrier group and replaces your bolt carrier group in your rifle, which means you're using the same optic, you're using the same optic height, you're using the same sling, you're using the same trigger. All the same things that you would be using is now just going to be replaced with this bolt that now allows you to be able to use it as a laser dry firing gun. So if you're going to set this up for a home defense training scenario, things like that, nothing is going to change because you're using all your regular gear, just using a different bolt carrier group that's going to function as a way of being able to project the laser. Now, the way the trigger system actually works is very interesting. So on the side of the bolt carrier group, there's a little attachment over there where it's right next to the on and off button. You plug in a wire. That wire leads down to the back portion of the trigger and it comes with a whole set of different types of weights as well as also different types of spacers that allow your trigger to function while you're using the system. So again, there's two aspects. There's the spacers and then there's the weights. What the spacers do is make sure that there's enough distance between the firing mechanism and the trigger that allows it to make sure that it's being pressed and being able to go off. Besides that, the weights are going to be these little, uh, little discs almost that go into that little piece as well. And what that does is the more discs you add, the more weight the trigger is going to have. So depending on the type of trigger you have, you can match the trigger weight to the weight that your rifle would usually have, which again, it gives you more of a realistic feel of your actual trigger, which I think is also very valuable. So once you have it set up, it magnetically attaches. So again, there's no permanent modification needed to your system. You attach it to the back of the trigger, that attaches to your bolt carrier group, and then you're pretty much ready to go. Now, on top of that, besides for that, they do again have laser systems that you're able to use on your actual pistols. So besides for the rifle aspect, there's the pistol aspect as well. So you can practice those mechanics as well. Another thing that's able to really take it another step up is going to be the training aids that you use for your laser targets. So they do have a bunch of different laser targets you're able to get. So one of the sets they sent out, sent out to me, which is really cool, are these uh, individual uh, little target styles you're able to get. They come in all different sizes. So there's a five inch target, there's a three inch target, there's a human size versus, not human, 
unit size, but a human design versus kind of like a regular bullseye looking target. And what that does is that attaches onto a system that looks like this. Now, this particular one is the remote. So there are a few different ones that come in the kit. I'd highly recommend you get the kit because you're able to get all the stuff you need in one place to be able to make the whole experience better. Now, what I'm holding is a remote. So you could see uh, what this has is an antenna over here. So you could set up these targets anywhere and you could have this right next to you and you pretty much activate it by pressing a button and it will create those targets to do different drills. So there are preset drills that are inside of this, whether that be transitioning from one shot each on each target, whether it's two shot, shots each on each target, there's kind of a free play, which means once you turn it on, it's just gonna let you know if you impacted any of those individual targets. So there's a lot of different ways you're able to utilize the system and there's a visual and audible feedback of you making sure that you're actually hitting it. Now, a question that's probably gonna come up is how do I know if it's zeroed? Well, obviously this is something they thought through that when this is in your actual bolt carrier group, there are two Allen screws that you could do similar to your regular zeroing of your rifle that you're able to zero it to your optic. So again, if you want a 50 yard zero, if you want a 25 yard zero, your optic is already set up for that because your optic is already zeroed and you just move the laser into the area that you want it to be and it will be zeroed with your optic and then it functions very well. Now, what's cool is that they actually have two systems available. This one that I'm holding right now is a visible red laser. They also have this one over here, which is an infrared, which means if you kind of want to make sure you're not cheating, quote unquote, right? To make sure that you're actually just focusing only on your red dot and you don't see a visible laser at all, you could use an infrared laser, which means that you won't see the impact um, with your eye, but the target will read and will identify if it was hit or not. So it kind of gives it almost a different level of training experience where you're going to make sure that you're only focusing on your reticle and you're not focusing on the laser that's being projected. On the bottom of the bolt carrier group, there are a couple of different lights that will indicate different modes that the laser is going to function in. So the key one that I want to mention is that there is a function that once you press it, the laser stays on, which seems kind of counterintuitive, but that laser staying on makes it easier for you to zero. So you're not going to need to, need to pull the trigger, figure out where it hit, and then readjust and pull the trigger, figure out where it hit and do it again. You just leave it on and then move it all the way into the point that it's centered in your reticle, and then you're pretty much good to go. That's all it's needed in order to have this zeroed and ready to go. Um, it is a replaceable battery on the inside, so you don't need to worry about over time if it dies, sending it back and replacing it and going going through a whole process, which I do have on other training pistols that I've had in the past. This one is a replaceable battery, which means it'll outlast you in regards to length of time you're able to use it for. You get thousands and thousands and thousands of shots with one individual battery. So again, I wouldn't really be concerned about the battery life, but it is replaceable over time to make sure that you still have a lot of function from it. Uh, I'm sure there's a lot that I've missed out on this because there is so much to speak about on the amount of stuff that comes available in this kit. If you want information, please check the link in the description down below or into the pinned comment for more information. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. This is Raziel Cohen with NDFtraining.com. Thank you for watching.